AMG. On behalf of myself and Jessica Kill, we'd really like to bring Kirk Shaw and our director, Ernie Barbarash, down to the front. It took me two years to get John claude to work through a movie with me. I chased him down in Hong Kong. I chased him in Belgium. We have Ernie who made this great film. It's a real gift to be able to see this with you here and have you react to our work. So thank you all for coming. You're my big thank you. Uh, movies are really very much a team, team effort. Our Chinese partners are here, Henry Luck and uh, Liu Jun Min, and they want to say a word. I, I am very proud to be here to, for this event with you. Chinese cinema needs the world, needs to work with America, and we hope to make more movies with everybody in the world. Thank you. People who have worked on this movie have come here from all over, from London, Hong Kong, from Toronto, from Vancouver. Take a stand up, everybody's worked on the film, please. If this ends up on the internet tomorrow morning, I know a certain gentleman from Belgium who knows a couple of karate moves, and he will find you, and he will take care of you, and if you want to see how it's done, please watch Pound of Flesh. Thank you very much. for inspiration. Kirk Shaw from Odyssey Media, the uh, mastermind behind Pound of Flesh. How was it uh, getting this all together with Jean-Claude Van Damme? Well, it actually took two years to put this together. It took two years of sort of dealing with Jean-Claude and dealing with his people to get him to, you know, trust doing a film with us. No, it's, it's, it's a solid movie that didn't have to always rely on all of his physical stuff. It, it showcased him as a performer, as an actor. So me, I was at the right time and the right place, and they gave me a martial art movie, and I was good, good with martial arts, so everything was destiny, and I was lucky. We were looking to wait both for something that's a really solid, meaty script and a really good role for him, and also a production situation, which is very interesting to shoot it in China for the most part, and a little bit in the Philippines and because that allowed us to have a slightly longer shooting schedule and some great locations and so it was just a, a conflagration of different things that came together. I found that everyone was really nurturing but the entire experience was fairly intense. Everything was very physical and you had to learn a lot of the action stunts and all the rest of it. And you guys are quite busy this year, I understand. Yeah, we'll do 24 films this year. But it was very much the script and it being a very character-driven, interesting project for him that also had the martial arts that you know the fans expect. And you pulled off a lot of the stunts yourself? Yeah, most of them the world taught, but we were very lucky because we had a great guy called John who brought us off and he taught us all of the stunts. He's from Boston and he knew exactly what he was doing. I think people will see this as a wonderful, uh, wonderful character-driven script. And I think it's uh, those that do watch Jean-Claude will be very pleasantly uh, surprised at, at just where, where he goes. So I went back to Jean-Claude and said, let's do a movie in Belgium and we'll do a diamond heist movie and you save all the diamonds in the world. And when could we see that? We're gonna make it next fall. There's a, it's a great Cain and Abel story. Uh, it's just very uh, rich. Van Damme has the quality to be a great actor.